shooting through the passing lane. Lone Star Legend with the garden trip, and he's going to take advantage. And around the turn, the go. The Trotters have reached the back stretch. And a yard. Underway for the early lead. Firing out of there is West Point Judy. Right alongside of that one goes push up Hanover into second. Also moving on the outside comes Curly Q. Three wide up into third there is Highland Ridge. Back to fourth push over Hanover. Then it's two lengths to Copper Harbor fifth. Inside sixth is Laser Pointer and the early trailer Pucker up Hanover. And on a break there around that first turn went Curly Q, the uh, favorite with Smed's hammer at even money. Throws this one wide open as they get to the quarter in 30 and one fifth. That's Highland Ridge on the outside. Is that a long way out there now? And the first time starter finally going to clear West Point Judy, who settles back in second as they pass the 3 8 marker. Push over, hand over with Manzi in third. In line single file, Copper Harbor is fourth. Then comes Laser Pointer, fifth, followed by the shipper Pucker up, Hanover. And heartbreak for those who went with Curly Q today. That one's out of it at the back of the pack. They get to the half in 101 and 1 fifth. They're at the uh, 31 even for the second panel, I should say. And Highland Ridge now trots away by five. Looking good here with Tactor. Trying to stay close in the pocket is West Point Judy in second. Inside still third. Push over Hanover hanging onto the rail. It's a first over grind for Copper Harbor there fourth. Further back to Pucker Up Hanover. Inside sixth is Laser Pointer. But they're all chasing the distant leader, Highland Ridge. Three quarters, 130 even. 28 and four, the third panel. And Highland Ridge is beginning to get lonely out there on the front. He's out by 10. Way back to West Point Joy and Copper Harbor third. At the top of the stretch, the only one you see, Jimmy Tactor and Highland Ridge out by about 15 now. It just keeps getting longer and longer, and Highland Ridge making a mockery of race six here. Going to coast home for the victory. Battles for the place, and that's going to be won by Pucker Up Hanover second, Pushover Hanover third. Highland Ridge is easy as pie in 159 and four. And Jimmy Tactor there, all by him lonesome with Highland Ridge and trotting up a storm she is. And first lifetime start and a big win, a 159-4, and four, an easy winner here. Seven, Pucker Up Hanover will be second best. The other Hanover horse, Pushover Hanover, will be third. Looks like a 6-7-3 finish coming up, 159-4 and four for the mile. Ladies and gentlemen, moving into the winner's circle at this time, the unofficial winner of this afternoon's sixth race, that's the sixth Highland Ridge. Two-year-old Bay Philly, excuse me, Brown Philly by Tom Ridge out of Gwyneth Hall by Malabar Man. Bred by Walnut Hall Limited of Kentucky, owned by Christina Tactor of East Windsor, New Jersey, John Fielding of Ontario, and Free Money Stable LLC of Bethlehem, Pennsylvania. 
trainer and the driver, Jimmy Tactor, Highland Ridge, uh, the 7-2 third choice on the board. Boy, once she got on the front end, she just blew this field away in her debut today. She gets the victory in 159 and 4 fifths. That's the six, Highland Ridge.